like, yeah, man, you know, this is serious, and we're incredibly lucky to be out here, like, riding sticks down the snowy mountains. It's unbelievable. We should get a fire shot. We should like lift up and in the smoke and in front of us leading the charge. Yes. We're in a snowmobile convoy train and trucks headed by a moose. Look at it, look at it, it's right there. straight drop off on one side. We're like, where the hell are we going? I ended up getting up into this little cul-de-sac and there's like four little cabins and that's, that's pretty much our new home for two weeks. We're out there for 10 days and went out every single day, six in the morning to seven o'clock at night. It's just long days, long snowmobile rides. Oof, that trail is just death. But there's three snowmobiles stuck. But I guess, uh, yeah, against all odds, we're gonna go snowboarding. <laughs> It's that important to us. Arab's got a really unique, cool style. It's like more old school, you know? It's like he likes to snowboard in the mountains where you're actually supposed to be snowboarding. of uh they've done extensive uh searching on google earth and whatnot and just ripping their snowmobiles around so they've found some pretty amazing zones the beglin arnardia zone is awesome it's just this little cliff band of trees with like big tall stack on both sides and then kind of like this weird shoot spiny thing in the middle of it it's just like this little little pocket of awesomeness in the middle of the woods and here it is now we're talking narzonia yeah. the far oh, left back I think that's the best line on film. Yeah, that was amazing. That is. So stoked not to be bored with you, bro. Oh my goodness. It's like nine feet of pal. You can't move anywhere. Another awesome part about snowboarding, I get to go out with, you know, kids like Curtis. He's two years younger than me and I still get to learn so much from watching him snowboard. <laughs>
Perfect, go. Yeah. Elevator drop, hey? Well, he's got good mountain style. Noticed his sled skills immediately, so he's ripping there. And, well, he's not scared to go deep, so that was immediately seen. Yeah, my favorite thing to watch Curtis do was that big cab five off the cliff. Landed in these sick pillows, amazing. Most gorgeous hit of the trip, big cliff. Shandy and Penner discovered the whole zone and no one rides it out as good as those guys can run. Penner is the other half of the BC Action Adventures and he is like the most redneck, no board, I don't even know how to describe him. You have, you have to go out with him. Oh my gosh, it's Penner without bindings, full speed, sending it in his mining helmet. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's so with mining sick. Without bindings? It, these shots don't do it justice. You can't without tell bindings is stuff crazy. Is. Penner is a... Best snowboarder in the world. And Shandy's probably the best snowboarder in the world. <laughs> they make an amazing crew. Shandy's probably ridden all that stuff, I don't know, a hundred times. He just goes there for fun, sends it. I'd love to see a movie of just Shandy riding in his zone. It's like everyone snowboards but me. You get a bunch of vibes for a whole bunch of years and you just take it. It's kind of like logging. He lets us like film the zone and we do all the things that you see, you know, like, okay, that pillow popper, there we go. And then he sneaks up there and he just does the craziest line after doing no snowboarding. And if he doesn't get it, he goes right back up to get it. Even if the pillows are gone and there's like dead snags sticking out everywhere, he doesn't really care. He rides pillows better than anyone I've ever seen, that's for sure. And I'm like, oh, come on, come out! <laughs> Saw the boys dropping in and I was like, get me up there. Showed up and I was like, here it comes. I just want to watch Sandy send this thing. Pretty much came in and then freaking went hoss. It was amazing. Sure enough, Shandy shows up and that was the most insane thing we've seen since we've been in Canada. Oh my That middle God. air was fucking big. We started up some fires. And that's amazing to get to like do some lines and then chill by the fire, dry your gloves off, put a hot dog or two. Right now. Holy shit! The spine of God. It is mental. I've never even seen anything like that before. We are here for the spine of God. We have never seen anything like it. It's definitely the coolest place I've ever seen. Rode the spine of God. Godly. Spine of God! <laughs> I could do that line a few times in the day. That was awesome. Explosion! <laughs> you Penner! <laughs> Penner going bad shit crazy. Yeah, you fucking stomped it. <laughs>